Ranking my top 10 favorite Kendrick Lamar songs, starting with 10th place, I have You off of To Pimp a Butterfly. Kendrick does a great job of displaying his emotions on the song, and that paired with the great production on the song, the beat switch, makes this a top 10 song. In ninth place, I have All Right, also off of To Pimp a Butterfly. This song used to be even higher on my list, but as I dwelled more into Kendrick's discography, it dropped a little bit. Still a great song though, has great Pharrell production. Um, also a very empowering song, big moment for Kendrick's career and hip hop in general. In eighth place off of Good Kid Mad City, I have Bitch Don't Kill My Vibe. This song is just super catchy. The hook is fantastic um, and it's a really good melodic performance from Kendrick. Moving towards section 80, in 7th place I have High Power, which has a great beat produced by J. Cole, which I didn't really know about until recently, but besides that, Kendrick also just has a great presence on this song, showcasing his aggressive style of rapping. And now for something the complete opposite, in 6th place I have Pride off of Damn. This song's beautiful, it, it's just beautiful, great singing from Kendrick when he hits those high notes. At first it took me a little bit to get used to it, but then, I mean, it, it's just a beautiful song. Next, also off of Damn, I have Duckworth. This song has really great storytelling. It's simple but effective. It's also just a great closing to Damn, where it reverses through the whole album at the end of the song. Moving back to To Pimp a Butterfly, in fourth place, I have Wesley's Theory, which could honestly be my number one, but these last four songs are so close together. Um, with that being said, Wesley's Theory has a really nice chaotic beat uh, that Kendrick is rapping on. The hook to start the song is... It does its job, it hooks me into the song, and all around, it's perfect. However, what I like a little bit more is Mad City in my third spot. Might be my most played, I think it is my most played Kendrick song. Uh, two really perfect verses um, that line up with each other well. The beat switch is great, and once again, another perfect song from Kendrick. And in second place, I know I said Duckworth has really good storytelling, but Sing About Me, I'm Dying of Thirst. I don't even know how someone could do that. Like, I don't know how someone can can write that well and just like, it's it's actually surprising to me how good this song is in terms of storytelling and lyrics, um, all the perspectives and how, how deep this song goes. I don't go back to it that much. So it's not number one. Um, replay value is not everything, but it, it is something to me. So it's not my number one, but it's my number two. But in first place, I have Money Trees. I feel like it's the perfect balance between something like Mad City and something like um, Sing About Me, I'm Dying of Thirst. It has great storytelling, but I also want to go back and listen to it on the daily. And that is my list.